Yo, what's going on? It's your boy KB Tindall, man. Right now, you're back with 10 TV, man. Third anniversary of the Rodriguez show, Santa Ana, California. Right now, I'm chilling with the man, Agala, the Don Bishop. What's going on, B? Oh, man, beautiful, man. Just, you know, new album coming out in May. Just got off tour. The Ag Al Gould, No Mercy for the Week tour. You know, the album's dropping in May, you know. Shout out to DJ Premier, spinning that, you know what I mean? That's Slug for you, featuring Vinny Paz right now, heavily. You know, keeping that street hot, man. Keeping the streets hot, man. That's all we got right now is the streets, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what make this music so raw. I'm out here at the Rodriguez show, about to get on stage in a minute and do my thing, man. That's what it is, man. Yo, tell man, you got so many years in the game, man. What keeps you, what keeps you moving, man? What keeps you doing what you do, man? Yo, I mean, my drive is like this, man. I, you know, I got so many... Uh, accolades producing people, you know what I mean, for years, like Buster, EPMD, Big Pun, Tony Touch, Big Daddy Kane, KRS-One, sure, sure, Cool G Rap, you know, I, I studied under that, you know what I'm saying, I studied under that, and, and kind of like, you gotta become your own, you know what I mean, I was riding with EPMD, with Eric Sermon, shout to them, I'm on their new album, their new collabs album, and plus, you know, I'm producing my, my own stuff, so, it's a respect, man, when you got Premier, when you got Eric Sermon, when you got these people telling you your shit is incredible. And they, Diamond D, I'm on Diamond, shout out to Diamond D. No doubt, no I'm doubt. on Diamond D new shit too. So it's like, it's a blessing, man, like, to keep that, to be a part of that legacy, it's a blessing. Yeah, man. I, I, you know, and I'm still here, you know what I mean? I'm still carving out my space, you know what I'm saying? But the next album, crazy. Next album, No Mercy for the Week. We ain't no playing no more. Week. Now, we ain't playing with niggas, G. Straight up. <laughs> That's Straight what I'm up. talking Boom. about. That's what I want to hear. That's what I want to hear, man. Um, if, if, you had to, if you had to think of, like, one big difference, man, between, you know, people that were spitting bars like the legends that you mentioned, as opposed to like what we're hearing nowadays, not to knock anybody what they're doing or nothing like that. Right, right, but what right. what would be the one big difference that you would that you would point out? Well, technology. You know what I'm saying? Okay. At the end of the day, it's all technology out. You know what I mean? Like, you know, hip hop is coming from a, a, a was coming from a raw place. No doubt. But now it's more um, uh, novelty-ish. You know what I mean? Mm. To become a rapper, it ain't it ain't no longer the street cred dude, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got the kid from middle America that going to high school, you know, living an American life, rapping about his life with no disrespect. Right. But, you know, man, I, I, I protect a certain brass, you know what I mean, of, 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 of artists that's, that's long, long lived in this game, still sure. got longevity. Yeah. And I think that's the difference too. Where's the longevity at? That's some, something that, that, that a, lot of, a lot of cats, I think, you know, are missing in this day and time. Some of them don't have the tools to get to where, you know, uh, uh, artists is. You know, you got PR, marketing, all that, but, right, right, right. you know, the streets, and people like your music, they gonna like your music. You just gotta get out there the best way you know how. So, you know what I mean? Just stop, you know, stop acting like you know, the internet is everything. You gotta go pull up on real yeah, niggas yeah. and go like, look, fam, I got some shit. Let me let me let That's you hear it. it and then days. if a real nigga yeah. like his shit, he gonna go bump it, listen to listen. Yo, you hear my, my man and them shit? Yeah. Boom, boom, shit hot. You know what I mean? And, and real niggas always been the promoters of this rap game. Absolutely. Don't get it fucked up. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Like that's what that's the era I come from. Yeah. So you know. I always, I always appreciate the new way of people interjecting with the community and bringing their music forth. Man. You know, CDs out the trunk, you don't see that no yeah, more. You don't see, you don't see the grind. Yeah. You don't see the yeah. groundwork like they did yeah. seven, ten years ago. The groundwork is important. Yeah, it's to very me, important. Yeah. I got, I, I got to shake hands and kiss babies. You got to get out there and touch the people. Got to shake hands and kiss babies yeah. out here. You know what I sure. mean? With the germs and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, man. Definitely, man. So uh, just tell everybody, man, at Ted TV, man, how they can follow you on social media, man, and keep up with what it is that you're doing and cop that new joint that you got dropping. Yeah, um, Agalaw Music on Instagram. You can follow me um, on Facebook. Uh, check me out on Twitter, Ag Agalaw the Dawn on Twitter, and um, Propane Campaign on Instagram. You know what I mean? My business, you can just check me out, buy some music, get some clothes. Get fly with me. I, I drop game to you. I spit a ball for you. Whatever you need, nigga. I'm here. Do it all, man. Definitely. Aguilar, man. Yo, it's a pleasure, man. Always a pleasure, B. Shout out to the old motherfucking team. Drop jewels. We here. Yes, sir. We out, man.